What's up, guys? We got a video here today of leftists losing their mind over the election. I waited a couple days to do a video like this. Um, I didn't know if I wanted to or not, so I said, screw it, let's send it. You know, if you like the video, don't forget to smash that like button, hit that sub button, and light up those comments after you watch the video. Let me know what you guys are feeling. And uh, yeah, enjoy the video. Let's go. All right, let's check this out. Let's check this out. How did we get here? How did we get here? What in the Alice <laughs> in Wonderland nightmares is going on right now? All I can say is how fucking dare you? Yeah, how dare us want, you know, a better America? How dare us? We're so bad. We should be fucking ashamed of ourselves. If you voted for that man, if you voted for anybody other than Kamala and you live and you live in one of the states that it was, you know, close or if you didn't vote, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> fuck us, right? Go Kamala. <laughs> oh no. Yes, I chose family, I chose women, and I chose America as well. You know what I mean? If I had any doubt in my mind that uh, I thought President Trump would ruin my wife's life or my daughter's lives, you know, do you think I would have voted for him? No. Come on. I love you. How the fuck is this still happening? All I've ever known politically is hatred. I'm done. Well, a lot of the hatred is coming from that side. I'm not going to lie. Like, I've met hundreds of Trump supporters. Not one of them has been mean to me in any way, shape, or form. And I always was in the middle. I never knew which side to go for, you know. And they've always accepted me over there. And I've always been called nasty names on that side. You know what I mean? So... I'm done. I'm done. I'm done with you. I'm done with you and your mother and your sister. I'm just done with all of Why would he be done with our mother and sister if that side was trying to protect the women, you know? I don't I don't get his logic. This. <laughs> <laughs> If this guy does end up winning, there's nothing to be afraid of. You know, it, it's it's either he is going to make America great again or he doesn't. You know what I mean? There's nothing to be afraid of. You know, he's already making pretty big moves and other countries are kind of like seeing, OK, well, Trump's in office now. Let's kind of back off what we've been doing. That's good. That's good. You're good. All of the people who voted for him will be like happy and they'll just be celebrating. And everyone else, everyone who feels threatened by him is fucking scared. Like we're, we're scared for our lives. We're scared for our friends. How okay. I don't think everybody is happy and I don't think anybody will be happy until Trump does what he says he was going to do. Right. I don't, I don't think us winning the election right sure it makes us happy for a couple days but we really won't be happy until he says what until he does what he says he was going to do you know what i mean so there's that dare you put this man into office for another four years knowing damn well what it means for our country what it means for us as a people to know that there is that much ignorance and that much hate in this country it's so terrifying it's so terrifying how the fuck are we back in this same situation again well who the fuck is voting for him genuinely literally a majority of the country <laughs> hey, fuck you i don't want to hear about how shitty your life gets under his policies Honestly, my life's gotten better, and he's not even in office yet. So, uh, yeah. Anybody else? 
live with that decision. Sit with it. Oh. Let it make you uncomfortable. Oh, yeah. Well, Fuck y- you. Your stare makes me uncomfortable, but we'll get past that. Nice little video. Yeah. So, <laughs> I don't know what to say, you know, like people can get mad, people can be upset, you know. I didn't do any of that when Trump lost in um 2020, you know. Um it is what it is. I get it. Americans are upset. Um but like what can we do? You know, if the majority of America says, hey, we want this guy in office, that's democracy, you know? So that's that. Uh, I just thought it would be kind of funny to look at some of these videos, see your guys' reactions to it. Uh, leave it down in the comments below. I think, I think they'll get over it when they see Trump doing what he says he was going to do. And it actually does make America great again. And the cost of living goes down. Um, It's easier to buy a house. You know, I think that if they see that happening, they'll kind of get out of this. You know, I know some of them are shaving their hair, which, you know, most of them don't even date dudes anyway that are shaving their hair. So it makes no sense why they're doing it. But like, that's just my opinion. You know, I stand with Americans, whether you're, you know, gay, straight, black, white. It doesn't matter if if you live here in America and you're doing, you know, right by other Americans and paying your taxes and working hard. I support you and I always will. So, you know, it is what it is. I think people will get over it. As the years go by and if they don't well you know what can we do you know what I mean we'll just stay doing American shit so yeah that's it I mean leave it in the comments below if you're freaking out over this uh, if you're happy about it just let me know I want to hear your guys's take on it Um, yeah if you guys like that video I got a couple other videos, you know, maybe check them out. Maybe don't. Who knows? Have a good one. Catch you on the next one.